Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today in this video we will discuss about split view in our QTQML application and also we will see its basics property and how to implement this split view or use this split view in our application. So let's start. So let's first of all import the QTQ control. Now let's create the split view. So first of all set the id my split view ok now let's set the height and width property so let's set the height and width property same as it window or parent window ok so anchor dot fill equal to parent ok now let's add the component into our split view so let's create the rectangle control and add in our split view so here we have to define the width and height property so let's define the uh, 200 also display the some color here so let's define the uh, any specific color okay so let's define the red color okay now let's set the uh, some text property inside of our uh, rectangle so my rect text one so here let's define the uh, first view ok now let's create the same as it second rectangle change the here object name this is the uh, third view and this is the second view ok now let's run the application and check it also let's set the some font property here so font bold equal to true or font dot point size is equal to a uh, 15 copy the same property for a uh, second rectangles and third rectangle now let's run the application and check it So you can see the uh, split view this is the first this is the second and this is the third one okay let's change the uh, color here we forgot to change the uh, color so set the uh, green color and then blue and check it again So you can see this is the first third view, second view, and this is the first view. Okay. Also, you can apply the uh, minimum or maximum width and height property here. Here you can also set the as a zero or completely close as any specific view. But let's change the up or apply the base uh, minimum width and height property. So split view. minimum width let's set the 100 or also set the minimum height is the uh, 100 also now just simply copy these two lines for other rectangles and now let's check it so you can see the default uh, and minimum width is 100 and you can also uh, assign or change the uh, view view size default value is under minimum value is under so you cannot uh, go below uh, 100 okay but you can also maxi uh, increase the uh, split view window here yeah. also you can change the uh, orientation also so now let's change the uh, vertical orientation you can see the uh, split view windows are displayed in vertical vertical manners okay and also you can change the uh, height and width property here i also change the uh, window application size and based on you can change the uh, view of your slash, uh, split view okay so this is the split view control 
in our QTQML application and please drop your comment if you have any questions about split view control in our QTQML application and please like this video and share this video with your friend and subscribe to my youtube channel and press the bell icon to get the notification of new video and thanks for watching my video thank you